Before we go into the video, I would like to announce the winner for the previous giveaway and I would also want to do another giveaway in this video. So to enter, hit the subscribe button, leave a like on the video and leave a comment down below telling me maybe one positive thing that happened to you recently in this very negative period of time that we have recently. Just want to spread the love to you guys and maybe you can read some comments and find some more positivity down there. One funny thing that happened to me actually happened at the end of this video. So if you want a good laugh, you can skip to the end or uh, watch to the end. Hey guys, Sean B and today we're back with more patch testing and the test subject for today will be the pumpkins. We're playing with Chilling and Misty. He's on Swift Revenge Attack Good Damage Attack. I wanted to go for a more damage build. That's why we're going with Swift Revenge. And for Misty, I'm going in with a Violent Blade Speed Good Damage and Attack build. So both are kind of aggressive and I like it that way. For Chilling, they buff the amount of speed you can gain from the passive. After playing so many new gacha games these days where they put the freaking damage formula and value and math calculation in the skill description. So you know exactly what kind of value you're getting. So it's much better to calculate your strategy. Going back to summoners who are looking at this kind of skill description and also the kind of patch note they give you ease the condition or like increase the value but never really say how much kind of pissed me off a little bit like just put the value right here what's wrong with letting us know the exact value of all these different skill for misty they change him quite a fair bit they replace the glancing debuff in his skill 2 with defense break which is really really good but Every hit in his skill 2 will grant a random effect between defense break, attack power break, and heal block. It's quite similar to Theoma's triple crush, but triple crush can consistently land defense break with 70% per hit. For ghost appearance, is inconsistent per hit and each hit will only have 50% max skill. His skill 3, the passive, got changed quite a fair bit as well. They kept the immunity against inability effects, but they changed the attack power gain entirely. He used to gain more attack power according to beneficial effect on himself, and also gain speed according to number of harmful effects on himself. Which is okay, but not too amazing because realistically, you only have 2-3 to three buffs the entire game. And you don't really want debuff on yourself. You get defense break, you're probably gonna die after that. If you get slow debuff, then your speed gain is also kind of cancelled out. So not too sure about that. I didn't feel good about this passive in the past. But right now it's pretty good because this kind of condition is really easy for him to gain stack compared to the fire monkey king whereby you need to hit him for him to gain stack so you can kind of avoid giving the fire monkey king stack but you can't avoid giving the light jack-o-lantern misty extra attack power because you only have to take a turn it's even easier than the five star dragon knight jaeger condition for him enemy need to attack or grant harmful effects which is already kind of easy for him to gain maximum stacks all right triple light team let's go in with attack buff and then what we are going to do is we're going to push back the Juno attack bar and then we're going to go for ghost appearance. This is zero stack, by the way. Let's go. Ooh, oh, nice violent. And I'm going to finish her off. Easy. One stack, two stack, but we need to heal right now. We need to heal right now. That is very painful. We healed up. Okay. We're going to try to push back the Varad attack bar, push back the retouch attack bar. We push back the Varad, we do some more damage. Oh, nice Violent. We put Ghost Appearance. The damage is okay, you know, nothing too amazing. I tried him out in the past and he is nowhere near Swal Chimera, okay? Boom. Oh, we're doing solid stuff now because we're getting stacked. And somehow we're proccing Violent every turn. 9,000 per hit on that retest right there. I would say... Only four stacks so far, and we're already doing pretty amazing. Ghost appearance. Ooh, solid. The variety was kind of healthy, right? It was kind of healthy. 
and he dropped really really low okay nice damage nice damage and here comes the oh that's not good that is nowhere near good i don't know what to do now i hate it when this defense don't work like how they're supposed to work um if i buff i'm giving odin buff which i don't like i'm gonna hit the commune so that the shield will fall onto the commune okay we steal the buff i'm gonna heal up a little bit here i can't kill him just yet or should i just go straight oh i do way too much damage let me let me do this let me try to defense break this guy no we can't land the defense break oh no this is not good this is definitely not good um i'm gonna steal all his stuff first okay he's gonna hit oh but he's gonna steal oh i shouldn't have steal his stuff i should have just ah uh, i'm stupid now okay defense break at least we're controlling the guy with and now we're gonna go with a different route okay <laughs> oh my god i don't know what to do um do i need to heal i kind of want to take away the attack break more than healing okay and i need to start killing the commune somehow uh should i go straight for i'm gonna kill the commune okay we kill the commune we can't kill the commune uh oh we're in trouble sleep again i can't sleep sleep again please okay okay triana triana you are doing a very good job but now defense break on my swishy unit i'm killing the commune easily okay and we are killing this thing one and he died but our girl get another turn easily and now i'm gonna try to defense break him no defense break oh my god he's still moving do i have the passive triana okay triana does have the passive i'm gonna heal him and then we're gonna try to uh, we still have to give him the buff if we're stealing the thing. So, oh, he didn't take the buff. Good. Defense break. And then we finish him off. Okay. Oh, we did some very good damage. Do you see that? Okay, let's buff. And now, oh, full buff. Okay, defense break maybe? Defense break. Okay, now I really want to just see the damage. I'm full buff chilling. Yo, that's 10,000 per head default attack. Swift revenge, baby. Attack could damage attack. 10,000 per head. That's not bad. I like that. This is kind of YOLO, but we're going to go in. Oh, we take the bomb just fine. I'm going to try to defense break this guy. Okay, we land nothing. And this is going to proceed with the trainer passive. And they're going many, many turns, which means my Misty is gaining a lot of different stack. Let me try and do some damage to... Let me try to kill Sierra first, okay? Try to kill Sierra. Oh, many, many turn, many, many turn, which mean many, many stack and many, many damage. Okay, that is not good. I think my boy might die soon if I don't land my passive, okay? I need my passive. I need my... He can't... He can't violent proc. Okay, he can't violent proc. Is he violent procking? Okay, he's not. Do I have the trainer skill? Do I have the trainer skill? I do have the Triana skill, so we good. The two bombs are gone, but I need to kill that that thing, that Eladro. Okay, he's kind of low. We're going to try to defense break, maybe? Oh my god, it's a high resist Eladro, but it's going to die now. He's going to die now. Okay, good. So the damage is kind of spread out. We slowed out the Sierra. It's kind of working. It's kind of working. The bomb can't kill me if I have cleansing every single turn okay okay triana okay triana you want you want to be showcased don't you i know you got some crit damage build going on i know you're doing good but you gotta chill <laughs> this triana has to chill oh my god we're doing great for this one it's gonna be tough though because i'm not too sure how i'm gonna win this because actually let's go with all the buff okay we're so fast right now okay look at chilling look at chilling speed i'm almost getting another turn and john over there is like not even moving at all okay just don't hit chilling just don't hit chilling good oh oh, 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 oh hey, slow it down good slow it down i'm gonna do this boom and i'm gonna try to pop the endure here okay we didn't steal anything we're gonna heal it up so that he won't focus on my chilling that's the important part but the the healer over there you know that thing that thing oh i move in between i'm so fast i just zoop right in between and kill the enemy theo we win 
We win already. That's the power of chilling. We can kill Theo through the Endure, which is amazing. Now, oh my god, look at how much damage I'm doing on that John. And it's lucky that he's not doing this on my chilling, so the damage will not be focused on him. We have speed buff and speed debuff if we can do that which means our team is significantly faster than enemy, especially Chilling. Chilling is way too damn fast. Um, I'm going to just steal that real quick and slow it down. Okay, sleep. Nice. Okay, healed up. Now we just have to wait for the John to get off her immunity as well so we can put some slow debuff and also defense break on her. Can I sleep? Oh my god. Come on, come on. One more, one more. One more, slow it down, slow it down. Okay, I can't slow. I really need the slow, but my chilling is way too fast for my animal. Like, I can't land a defense break. Can I now? Okay, good defense break. Can I kill? Can I sleep one more time? <laughs> one more time? Oh my god. You know what? Anvil and Triana are kind of pissed they are not the main girl of the show. All these pumpkin out of nowhere. Just stole the show from these two ladies. But they are showing me they deserve to be on a thumbnail as well. <laughs> I like it. This is this is so much fun. So the Lima can now strip and slow debuff. And she can also do many, many scary things. Push back. Okay. What do I do now? I think Lucia can finish him. So I'm going to put slow debuff on the Lima. Okay. Slow debuff. He's going to try to hit my Misty. Ouch. Okay, can I kill? I have to kill. I have to kill. Yeah, baby. 64,000. Ain't nobody gonna survive that. And now we're doing some good damage on this guy. Nice damage. And here comes the buff with the extra immunity. But is that gonna matter? Um, Yeah, it kind of matter. Right? It kind of matter. Misty's dead. But I still have my, my boy Lucia here. Can I boom? Nice damage, nice damage, and El Sharion is gone. So, the immunities, one more buff is always nice to have. We healed up a little bit, and we push her back a bit more. I think on offense, she's going to be better, because in defense, I don't think one turn immunity is going to be like, whoa, too amazing. Let, let's look at this. So, very well protected. In the past, without immunity, then she can be exploited pretty easily with just putting more stun on top of that. But right now, it's tough to do that to her. But it's only one turn, so you're just gonna wait it out pretty easily. 72,000. Now this one though, I gotta survive. So who do I kill first? I gotta take away Panda first, okay? And then we need to defense break him. Can I? Okay, give me attack bar, very nice. Defense break. No defense break. Oh, I got defense broken. No defense break. Okay, we might be in trouble. Can I stun? No stun. Okay, it's a very high resist panda. Not good. Not good at all because I'm going to get hit here. My panda might die. My panda might die. My panda is dead. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no. We dead, dude. We are so dead. Oh, nice stun. Do we have a chance here? No, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. <laughs> oh, my God. If we could land the defense break right there on the panda. I could have one shot him with Jean. One random crystal summon, maybe? Ooh! 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 <laughs> good job, Countess. Chasun used to be very, very good two, three years ago. Unstoppable heal, but nowadays not really that great because you need immunity to be good in this day and age, aka Fran. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Look at all these. Feels bad. <laughs> Feels bad. Ay, uh... Feels bad. All right, guys, that's it for the video today. Thank you so much for watching. I will probably build a dark pumpkin soon. He seemed like fun because he can get extra damage when he's having shield and is a full team shield, which is kind of cool. I don't know. But that's it for the video today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, smash the like for the Chasun. 
leave a comment down below subscribe to the channel if you're new and i'll see you guys next time bye